hotwirefoamcutterinfo.com presents the hanger bolt underside assembly. The hanger bolt is meant to be used with the medium sized vertical tabletop cutter but may also be used as an alternative underside assembly for the small scale tabletop cutter. The hanger bolt assembly is meant to be mounted directly into the underlying wood or PVC support structure. This is made possible because a hanger bolt has two different ends. On one side you have a wood screw which allows direct attachment to your underlying support structure and on the other end you have a machine screw. And to make sure this hanger bolt syncs up with all of our other components, we've chosen a 10-24 hanger bolt. And it may contain either a figure of eight hook or an extension spring. Pictured here is a figure of eight hook and is the recommended attachment. You should also notice that the ring terminal is attached directly to the machined portion of the hanger bolt. And in addition to the single 10-24 hanger bolt, we'll need one ring terminal, three 10-24 full nuts, one 10-24 wing nut, four number 10 washers, and a single figure of eight ring. Be sure to check the sequencing diagram for this next section and follow along. Please note that the hanger bolt should be attached to the underlying support structure before you proceed with the following steps. Please take care to not damage the machined threads when attaching the hanger bolt to the underlying support structure. We will also be using a previously made ring terminal and connection wire. Reference the website for additional videos. Take the 10-24 hanger bolt and begin by adding the first series of nuts, washers, and the ring terminal. The purpose of the first full nut is to prevent the ring terminal from sliding off the back side once it's attached to the underlying support structure. It also allows the washers to gain adequate compression on the ring terminal for a good electrical connection. You will now attach the figure of 8 ring, which should already have the nichrome wire attached. With tabletop cutters, you'll need to be able to adjust the position of the nichrome wire on the hanger bolt so that it lines up with the hole in the table's base. This component was chosen so that you may quickly change your nichrome wire should it break, as well as achieve a good electrical connection to your end cap assembly. And there you have it, the underside hanger bolt assembly. And don't forget that all the diagrams and additional videos are available on the website at hotwirefoamcutterinfo.com. And thank you for watching.